guys welcome back to my channel so today I'll be doing a self-care day I've had a long week of exams and I am just trying to relax so grab your wine and enjoy these peaceful vibes before we get into this video y'all already know hit that subscribe button and give your girl a thumbs up for more videos nothing says peace like a good smelling candle so first i'm gonna light my so simply candle this is a black owned business you guys so i will put their information in the description box below for you to check them out then i'm gonna move into my everyday skincare routine so i'm gonna start by cleansing my face with the neutrogena ultra gentle cleanser and i'm just gonna take my time to really get the dirt off clean my pores and just give my skin some love and affection if you guys want to know more about my skincare routine and what I use, what I do, I'm going to link that video above so you guys can check that out. Then I go in with my Aztec clay mask mixed with organic apple cider vinegar. This is my go-to mask, y'all. I love this mask. It's versatile. You can use it in your hair as well. So this mask is going to stick around for a long time. And I add a little bit of turmeric in it to fade the dark marks on my skin. I try to do this at least twice a week, but y'all know how it gets when you get busy, you have finals, you know, really stressed out with things you have to do. We tend to skip this step. So tonight I'm going to let it sit, detox my skin and work its magic. While I let my mask sit, I'm going to go ahead and run my bath water. I'll be putting in some Epsom salt to help relax my body and relieve the tension. And of course, a bath bomb. Y'all already know, it's, a bath is not complete without that. Now that I have rinsed the mask off, I'm going to go in with my moisturizer to finish my skincare routine. And honestly, you guys, I would recommend doing your moisturizer last. Well, I guess it depends on how thick your moisturizer is because by the time you sit in that hot tub, it's going to melt off <laughs> and then I'm gonna of course moisturize my lips with some Vaseline and lastly I go in with a little bit of castor oil on my eyebrows I don't know about y'all but my eyebrows are very patchy and I've been trying to grow them out I can't tell you whether it works or not maybe I'm not consistent enough but yeah Once I'm done soaking and taking a bath, I like to write in my prayer journal for women. I love this journal because not only does it allow you to read God's word, but it also allows you to write out your thoughts and really self-reflect on the past week. This journal can be found on Amazon, so I will put the link down below in the description box. This was such a great gift from my line sister and it was right on time. 10 out of 10, you guys, I definitely recommend. Thanks, Celeste. Right before I close my eyes, I like to read a few scriptures from this learning Bible. This has really been helping me learn the word and breaking it down to where I can understand it. So if you struggle with King James Version, I recommend Contemporary English Version. And once I'm done reading, it is time for me to call it a night. 
Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.